Hello. Good day, Andy here with Pop Yachts. We're ready to get those monster fish. We've got a 1972 Egg Harbor. This is the 33 foot sport fisherman. Quality built construction, designed for big heavy seas. Anchor windlass up at the bow. This is powered by a twin Mercruiser inboard motors. The entire top half's been redone. Got a very sporty cockpit design as well as upper helm. Beautiful teak wood. Nice extended swim platform back there for any dive days. And side access steps. This gives you access to the storage drawers. And got a massive live well on the port side here. Securely mounted ladder heading up to the flybridge. See if I can do this while I'm holding the camera. Got cool blue LED lighting up top as well on the lower deck here. Plenty of room. Garmin's 4210 GPS and fish finder unit. You got a polyplaner stereo system. And I believe the Ferrono screen's gonna need to be replaced for the radar. Huge bow. And just see cruising along and cutting in some big rollers. Plenty of rod holders up top here. And then redundant VHF radios in this lockable glove box. Storage underneath the dash. Canvas looks good on the top here. A little bit of pitting in the aluminum, normal for the age. And a little stowage area for life jackets. Nice comfortable captain's seat. Great visibility forward and aft right behind the helm here. Let's go ahead and check out the cabin. Double sliding doors for access. Good amount of headroom. Uh, I've got 6-3 clearance here along the center line. Rod holders up top. Nice sofa for lounging. Doubles as a futon, additional sleeping space. Jensen flat panel TV. A lot of the wiring's been updated. Can take a quick peek back here. Nice and organized. And forward, we've got a double width bunk with dresser drawers underneath. The forward cabin which has a filler cushion V-berth for two to sleep comfortably, either together or separate. And then onboard Jabsco head, sink inside here, and shower space. Looks like it's gonna need to be replumbed. Remote start for the generator, updated breaker panels, There's your hour meter for the generator, bilge pump controls, and AC controls. Plenty of counter space in the galley, the ice maker and refrigerator and freezer. Let's go ahead and get these engine covers off, take a look at them, and get them cranked up. This one's having some work done to it right now. Can peek 
get the Western Beak generator back that way. We'll get that started right now. Sounds good. It's a good clean on the outside, but other than that, a smooth operation. Sweet spot cruise for this, 22 knots, tons of deck space, ready to reel in those monsters, take some time, check out all of the high resolution photos we have posted on popyachts.com, and give me a call today, look forward to meeting you in person for a walkthrough tour, let's get you out on the water, fishing, cruising, and having fun.